episode number three, baby. You know what that means? You can see it right there in your top right of your screen. We've got 200,000 coins to build a squad, get a dub, and advance to a 400k team builder. We are getting up in coins fast. Last episode, we had a dilemma. After building my 100k squad, we got to rage quit pretty damn quick. And I looked through all of the comments. I saw all your guys' suggestions. And I made my decision. If we can force a rage quit, my reward will be to bring one player across from that team into my next team builder. Now, before I walk you through that decision, I want to show you the player. You may already know who it is, but drum roll, please. Say Quan Barkley. Saquon Barkley carried the squad. He was very expensive, but we still pulled it off. 88 speed, 88 excel, 89 agility. So we won't have to worry about buying a halfback on this episode. Now, let me walk you through the reason I made this decision. In case you don't like it, maybe I could pull you to my side. Now, I saw a lot of comments where people were talking about all these additional rules. They're talking about wheel spins, this, that, and the other thing. One thing I need you guys to understand, this is not Wheel of Mutt. Wheel of Mutt is its own thing. I'll continue to do Wheel of Mutt, and let's have fun with it. But this series is intended to build a team almost entirely from scratch. So whether you're a broke mutt player or a god tier big money spender mutt player, you're going to see an awesome team builder. You're also going to see that despite what you may believe, I'm not actually that much of a casual because I can run kids with god squads with my 50k team. So I threw out all the ideas with these big wheel spins and these big jackpots and all that. And the reason I like bringing one player across is the only thing I'm sad about with the series is we don't get to build a relationship with any of these players. You know what I mean? Like we might have a gold or a silver player who just goes off, but then next episode they're gone. So if we can force the rage quit, we get to see our hero one more time. Saquon Barkley was the hero of last episode. We're gonna get to see him one more time. So I've got my flat 200k. My hatback is already locked in. Let's get into building the team. Also, I have to shit on you guys one more time before we continue with this video. I see all these comments where people actually like tell me what player to throw to or like I missed a read. If you scroll all the way to the right here, look at this. There's a Madden competitive series. And I noticed in my comments that all of you are actually pro players because you never miss reads. I encourage you to sign up for Madden Competitive Series. Uh, this guy's career prize earnings are $256,000. You could have $256,000 in your pocket right now if you would just sign up for Madden Competitive. I was reading through the comments. Nobody ever misses a read. You know exactly who to throw to. So sign up and become a pro. Or maybe, maybe. Shut the fuck up. Up. So normally there's 25 positions I like to fill, but today there's only 24. I'm actually gonna spend big money on good offensive linemen. I'm gonna build a run game team. 7,500 coins here for Richie Incognito. He's got Polar Elite as well, already baked into the card. And I'll probably end up going cheap on my wide receivers. Gonna get all 86 or 87 overalls up on the offensive line. Wyatt Teller, 3,700. And now let's do right tackle. I still want a good tight end. Tight ends are my safety blanket. I love tight ends. Edge protector on Brian Balaga. We will go 84 here. All right. Spent some good money there on offensive line. We've yet to do that on a single episode. This is expensive, but this Kyle Pitts is so good. A 90 speed, big ass tight end. So he's got the speed of that Tyreek Hill we had before, but he also can block and actually play tight end. Unlike the Tyreek. The Tyreek Hill is basically just a wide receiver. I'm cool with literally 82, 83 overall wide receivers. I hardly use wide receivers anyway. The only thing I might want with wide receivers is big bodies so that they can block. Like an AJ Brown. He's a big boy. He's a strong boy too. We'll go AJ Brown for 1,600 coins. Easy. Legends, Brandon Marshall. Also, big body. Keyshawn Johnson's a big ass dude, right? 6'4", 211. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, wide receivers are locked in. Running back is locked in. If it's a run game team, we do legitimately need to buy a fullback. Zonka! I love Zonka, but Janovich has the abilities baked in. We gotta go, Jan. I do love my boy Zonka. Oh, I can't believe I just picked Janovich over Zonka, but whatever. All right, offense is complete. Minus a quarterback. Who's gonna be a little speed demon up there, huh? Russell Wilson, novice. 89 overall. Mm. The throws stats are very good, but I'm looking for like a 90 speed quarterback if they exist in here. Dude, do you guys want to hear something crazy? Which I'm just now realizing as I look at this 2010 Mike Vick. I've never used a Mike Vick this year. 17,000 coins for 88 overall Mike Vick. 88 speed, 87 throw power. I'm gonna do it. I literally have not used a Mike Vick card this entire year. Alright, let's move on to defense now before we look at our team. And I know exactly who 
I want at middle linebacker? Ultimate Legends just came out. There's an 87 middle linebacker, Ray Lewis. If you had to guess, you had to just guess off the top of your head, how fast is this Ray Lewis, right? I think if I had to guess, I would have said 86, 86 speed. And I'm usually pretty good at it. But you take a look at this 87 Ray Lewis for 14,000 coins. It's a 92 speed, 92 excel middle linebacker. He doesn't have the block shed and the hit power that you'd expect to see out of a Ray Lewis card, but he's way faster. It's like track star Ray Lewis. This is gonna be a nasty user. Logan Wilson, still amazing. There's a chance we'll see him on more team builders, honestly, just because for the value, the price for the value is crazy. 88 hit power, 89 speed, 91 excel, 87 tackle. He's an excellent middle linebacker for like 9, 10K. We've got 108K left to spend. We're already diving into our defense a little bit. Cam Gill, 86 overall, right outside linebacker with 90 speed for 4,000 coins. That is dirt fucking cheap. Left outside, I'll go Anthony Barr. 84 speed, 85 excel, nothing crazy, but he's 6'5", 255. I'm not gonna make the joke, but I like Anthony Barr cards a lot. If I accidentally have to use them, I'll be happy. Next most important is gonna be free safety, strong safety corners. We know this. That is 250 coins for Roy Williams. If I can get that snipe, I'm a fucking god. <laughs> I feel like I'm playing Madden Mobile. I just got 87 Roy Williams for 250 coins. Let's fucking go. All right, for now, I'm not gonna get a free safety because I just, I just went virtually zero coins out of free safety. Let's go. I'm gonna go big on strong safety now. Ooh, I'm pretty sure this Adrian Amos is like really good. 88 overall, 88 speed, 88 excel. He's a beast. You know, I would not have spent 12K on a strong safety, <laughs> but I can now. All right, let's get three solid corners. We got 87K. We're doing good so far. Oh, I'm pretty sure this Rocky Sin is sick. Just came out. Part of the new Gridiron Guardians, uh, whatever. Gridiron Guardians 2. I think Trey Herndon is in the exact same boat. He's really good because he just came out. Yup, 87 overall, 9,000 coins. A little expensive. We have not touched D-line yet, but money-wise, we're doing so good. And this is expensive too, but how can I pass this up? This Ronald Darby is so good. He's small. It's gonna be a lot of bigger wide receivers, but look at that. That's our corner one right there. Let's get a fast left and right end. Quentin Jefferson, speed rusher. You could be fast. 86, whoa. The playoffs promo is coming in clutch. Quentin Jefferson is way better than I thought he'd be. Gotta keep the QBs contained, bro. They can be just such a menace out there. Dude, you know who is a beast? I randomly stumbled upon this dude. He's such an animal. I don't really I, I've never heard of this guy. I don't know who he is. He played for Michigan way back in the day. Look at this motherfucker. 88 speed, 88 excel, right end, 85 overall for 4,000 coins. And at D-tackle, I'll go cheap. I'll take Puna Ford. I don't really mind with D-tackle much. Kenny Clark. I've never, never really noticed if my D-tackles play well or not. I rarely notice. I have 38,000 coins left over and I love my team already. I'm gonna put in the best possible lineup. I'm gonna look at how things look and we'll see where we can go spend a little more bread. I was thinking of a million different ways to start this video, but I can't be here right now. The biggest exodus in gaming is here and I'm joining the movement. I have to go. I'm just kidding. I just needed to grab my phone so that I could show off the best crypto wallet on the market right now. Exodus. Get it? Like a mass exodus. I thought it was funny. Whatever. Exodus is sponsoring today's video and I'm so excited to talk about it. I can understand why crypto can be really confusing, but Exodus makes it so simple. It actually has the look and feel of a video game, which is why it was a perfect app for me. You can invest and trade over 130 digital assets. They make a really complicated topic like crypto seem so incredibly simple. I'm pretty sure I could teach my grandparents how to use the Exodus app. Crypto is all the rave right now. Click the link in the top of the description. Get started with Exodus. You'll see for yourself just how easy it is to use and you can start investing and trading in crypto yourself. Exodus, thank you for sponsoring today's video, guys. Enjoy the rest. 85 overall team. This team is looking good. Mike Vick, Saquon Barkley, Andy Janovich, Keyshawn Johnson, Brandon Marshall, AJ Brown, Kyle Pitts. Awesome offensive line. Defense, we got this super spit. Such a good Ray Lewis. We got Cam Gill, Logan Wilson, Anthony Barr, AJ Amos, Dirt Cheap Roy Williams, Ronald Darby, Rakusin, Trey Herndon. The solid D-line, you know, it's kind of hard for me to decide what I shoot with this 38k i'm a little tempted to go see if i can get a better quarterback i do feel bad i, I straight up i do feel bad because i already spent good money on this mike vick but it's a very dumb decision by me and i gotta accept the consequences but 38 550 i could spread it out i could get backups i could get a backup halfback i could get a backup tight end i'm gonna see if i can get like a really good quarterback because as we saw with saquon it does suck to double up on buying a quarterback 
But imagine I get another rage quit and I can carry this quarterback over. There's a 90 overall Russell Wilson in my price point, 87, 89, incredible throw stats. He's a little bit slower than Vic, but a hell of a lot better at everything else. We can get a 91 Russell Wilson. Yep. Oh. He is nasty. All right. We got to take our out. We got to accept we made some bad decisions along the way, but that is our last buy. Let's pretend I had that 17,000 back from Mike Vick. I would have had 55,000 right now. Could have gotten a 90 overall Mike Vick. Oh, I could have gotten 90 overall Jalen Hurts. That hurts. Now, abilities wise, can Russell Wilson get escape artists? I assume so. But I saw recently, I think it's like 10 ability points for escape artists, which is just so fucked up. If you're an improviser quarterback, you want escape artists, it's 10. So I can't do that. That's detrimental to the rest of my team. I can't be doing that. There's a lot of things I want to do, but I think I'm just going to do identifier. I love identifier. And then run and gun, just in case we're slinging it. We have two offensive linemen with abilities, post up and puller elite. Balaga with edge protector, screen protector. Andy Janovich has screen protector, puller elite. Maybe I'll run some screen plays. That'll be fun. And then Saquon's got spin cycle, backfield master, recuperation, Russell Wilson with identifier. I love this build. Defensively, we have a 92 speed user. Ray Lewis, that's incredible. We got Roy Williams for 250 coins, which is so badass. Ronald Darby has 92 speed. Elroy Hirsch, 88 speed for 4K. Still got a bronze kicker in my sub linebacker. I'm actually gonna make Ray Lewis so that they don't accidentally put in somebody else. I want Ray Lewis always as my user. 450 coins left over to sit there and do nothing with. It's adorable though. We're ready to get into a head-to-head -head season. I saw some people in the comments saying like, hey, you know, there's nothing on the line in these games. In case you lose, you just play again. That is not true. I'm trying to get to a Super Bowl. If I lose four games before I get to the playoffs, I have no idea what we're going to do with this series. Like, I haven't even brainstormed it yet because I don't want it to happen. But uh, we can't just go out here and lose three straight games and, you know, pretend like nothing happened. I need to win. Either way, this team is so ready to go. I hope you boys are excited. Let's get this money. Ooh, I love this guy. His name is Make Him Quit. How funny would it be if I make him quit? Oh, you know what's so funny too? People are seeing my top three and they're getting so excited. It's like what I do in Wheel of Mud. They're clapping at their screens like, yes, I'm playing a bum. You think we uh, try and get on the quarterback? He's got Cam Newton back there. I'm gonna try and get on the quarterback. Fake it. Oh, left side is open. Ooh, doesn't get it off. Looks like a run. Is he? No. Ooh, nice throw. Our boy is marching here. Oh, come on. Oh, I wanted him to fumble so bad. Everybody's in coverage here. Yes, sir. Clamped. No, he's not. Jeez, what was that attempt at coverage? That was sorry. All right, you know what? We got Russell Wilson. We got a revamped offense. We got a run game offense. See if we can get down there. Let's make it happen. I kind of just have to hand it off, but the handoff should be very open. Oh my God, are you shitting me? They're putting up great blocks over there. I tell you what, look at those wide receivers blocking over there. We're just gonna go right underneath to AJ Brown. Great juke. I think of anything, most episodes, I could probably go cheap on wide receivers, which is so funny. Because most Maddens, that would never be the case. But they're just not that important this year. Uh-oh, you're not, uh-oh, uh-oh. We're gonna run the read option. Just gonna run it stock. Oh, left side is, what the f- Saquon! And he's still fucking real. Who are you? Now, what I like is we have two players with screen protector. Dominant impact blocks on screen plays. That's Brian Bulaga. And oh, I, I apologize. Janovich is not in, but he has the same thing. Let's see if this works. Oh, I'm actually just playing out of my mind with the Saquon right now. Because that really didn't set up that great. I got to remember we have spin cycle and not jukebox. We're going to go four verts. He's expecting a, he's expecting a run. That's going to be a blitz. Oh good, Saquon. Right back across, that Russell Wilson is a beast! What if we get our boy John Sully a touchdown? Oh, Sully. Sully! 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 He got that shit! Great job, 66 overall. John Sullivan, I think is his name. I actually don't even know. I should be able to hit Brandon Marshall in the middle here. Brandon Marshall, come on, baby. Oh, it's okay though. I do not think this game is gonna be determined by a point or even a field goal. I think I need to turn him over to beat him. Otherwise he will beat me by a touchdown. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, you got team of the year, Justin Jefferson and I've got bum fucking scrub McFucking homeless man. That was glitchy. 
Oh, I'm sorry, you guys. Did I miss a read? Is there a pass? Was there a wide open guy that I missed? Feel free to let me know in the comments. As you guys know, I'm a time traveler. I can go back in time, re-record the video, and then throw it to that guy that was open. So make sure you let me know in the comments if I miss any passes. Please let me know. The little assholes. All right, we're just gonna check this puppy down to who? Who is that? His name is Nada. There's not a chance I know who you are, bud. Who the fuck was that? Whatever, I mean, he made a good catch. Is that him again? Oh! Who are you? You're God! Russell Wilson is 7 for 7, 50 yards in a, in a tutty. Uh, with no time on that clock, we're just gonna snap this! Sully, are you gonna be open? Sully's in man here. So is Saquon, though. I like Saquon in man. That spin move is up. Impressive. Just gonna go four verts. I'm probably just gonna throw Saquon underneath. Pretty much a predetermined here. Hits underneath. I'm gonna block there. Second and ten. Ooh, wide open is Kyle Pitts. Oh, oh, what? He got that same animation three times? I seriously didn't want to score that fast. How the fuck did he get that same animation three times? I'm gonna send Saquon over the middle here. I think it's gonna get it. Saquon. Let's be very careful on this kickoff. Let's actually use or somebody try and get down to the guy. And if we can turn him over, score, then get ball at half, I actually think this game is going to be locked up. I'm always so confused how these dudes will have the craziest, crazy good offense and no defense. Whereas I'm like the polar opposite. Oh, no. I dropped that. I'm getting on the quarterback here. He doesn't have the blockers. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> no shot, you son of a bitch. Oh, you're sweating my dick. Why don't you give me a beer so I can shotgun it? I like to be a little tipsy before you take me out and fuck me oh. in my ass. How am I dropping this shit? Oh, and he's going to throw that laser, bro. Oh, I am mad. Unbelievable. This shit is ridiculous, man. We have an opportunity to march down here. Oh, Saquon's gonna burn his man there, 100%. Eight seconds on the clock. My kicker is ass. We have to remember that. My kicker is fucking dog water. So we gotta get nice and close if we're gonna convert one of these. This is cover three sky. Ooh, yes, sir, maybe. Great catch. I kinda gotta catch this. Oh my God! Karma! How do I fucking do it? I just scored with eight seconds on the clock. It's time for you to retire. Oh, yes. This is one of the highest scoring first halves I think I've ever played in my whole life. If I get this win, I do get to carry a play over, which would be sick as hell. But at this point, it's more of a pride thing. I want this win so bad right now. He's got a free touchdown off a of kick return. No. Yes. He's got a free touchdown off a of kick return. Two. I got two dropped INTs. We got to beat this dude. Another one. Oh, we're going to the fucking playoffs, baby. We're not just going to the playoffs. We're going to be upgrading the team in the playoffs. Next episode of Double or Nothing. We will have 400k coins to spend on one team. We are on a four game win streak. Two of them are rage quits. Three of them are rage quits. Wow, Saquon Barkley is so good, by the way. I am tempted to carry Saquon over again, which I don't think I really should do. That wouldn't be cool. I can carry over two players into our 400k episode. It's hard to say. Kyle Pitts. Holy shit. He is good. That could be one. Russell Wilson, 38K. I mean, this is what we did it for. So Russell Wilson really should be one. Ray Lewis, you know, am I overreacting? Is he still really good? I just I just unluckily dropped two. Because I'm not going to carry over Ray Lewis. I should carry over Ronald Darby. 92 speed, 93 excel. He's awesome. Who knows, boys? All I know is we caught two fat dubs today on double or nothing. I hope you guys love the new series. And I will see you. I'll see you in a couple days for episode number four. Where we got 400K on episode four to spend on one team. All right, boys. I love you. Thanks for watching as always. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.